Get Some Pet from Australia. What I wanted to say today is about mixing up the food you're giving to your cats and dogs. Number one, can you imagine if every day you got steak and veg for dinner, how bloody bored you'd get with it? very quickly and it's not just about the board i mean obviously dogs and cats have got a different mentality to us but i'm sure every time you get that they get the same kibble and meat or whatever you're giving them every day shoved in the bowl they're not going yeehaw they're just going oh well, i'm hungry i better better eat it otherwise i'll starve um it's a really good idea to give them variety because obviously different foods have different nutrients and key vitamins and minerals and so some days you can give them some veg in their thing, other days you, you know, you're in a hurry and you have to give them the horrible dry f uh, food, which I obviously don't recommend, but I get it. Some days you, you're rushing out the door and you don't have time to make a little gourmet meal for your cat and dog. Or make some pre-made meals um, and have that. So keep leftovers from you know your own food that you've cooked at night, like some mashed potato and the carrot and everything, and mash that up and put that in with there. Also, um, this is great for dogs. Is uh, I give um, my dog. He gets coleslaw without obviously the the yummy mayo all over it. He gets raw coleslaw. I give him kale. I give him organic egg. He'll get different even fruits and stuff. Just obviously look at the ones like you don't give them grapes. There's certain fruits aren't good for them. Cats are a little bit more tricky because obviously it's a bit hard to be mushing up all that stuff and putting it in their food. Um, and it, most cat owners are so used to just giving their cat the same dry cat food every day. So start transitioning and trying little different things to give them more variety in their diet. One, because they'll enjoy eating their food a little bit more because food's yummy and you like to enjoy it and you'd like them to enjoy it. And two, so you can give them a bit more variety so they you know some of the nutrients and vitamins that, that you know you can try and, and they're missing in that food they can be getting from other foods and as always as i say top it up with a good uh, quality vitamin and mineral supplement um for, for pets because this is can only help them okay thanks bye from gabrielle